Today we're back at Satellite Dry Lake. Um, I'm going to do uh, another video on turning. A couple days ago I did a video uh, with turning tips using my JXD388, but I really couldn't see the quadcopter in my video, so I wasn't really satisfied with it. So we're back again to, to redo that video, but this time I'm using my uh, WL Toys uh, V212. It's a much larger quadcopter and more easy to see while flying. I know that doesn't look like a V212 sitting there, but it is. I removed the canopy and the landing gear skid from it to lighten it up a bit. Uh, but uh, let's just go flying and redo that video on turning. <laughs> I'll go walk over here to the main field. First of all, this thing needs to be heavily uh, trimmed here. Let me bring it in closer. That's better. Okay, let's do this, do some flying with it. Um, I hope this is coming out better, but all I wanted to do was cover turning tips, particularly bank turns. Uh, that's a subject that's not clear to most people on how to do them. For bank turns, you want to keep a little forward pitch, some forward pitch to keep forward movement, and you apply both rudder and aileron in the desired direction of turn. I'm at 40% mode right now. I'm going to increase it now to 60% to increase the bank of these turns. And I got to bring this in a little closer so you can see this better. But notice how the quadcopter can turn in a bank. Uh, this is opposed to a simple rudder turn. Let's do a rudder turn. See how the, you get a lot of side slip with a rudder turn. A bank turn is, will give you a faster turn and a more smooth turn. Let's walk over toward it. Very simple to do. Forward pitch to keep it moving. And apply both rudder and aileron. And again, let's demonstrate the rudder turn only. This is just rudder only. Notice the side slip you get with it. If you apply aileron with it, you get a much smoother, nice, quicker turn. Now let's go one step further. How do I tighten up a turn, make a very rapid turn? You apply pitch also. You pull back on the pitch and that tightens up the turn. I'll do that again. See how I pull back on the pitch and the turn tightens? But you can only do like a 180 degree turn doing this because the quadcopter is more or less coming to a stop. As soon as you make the turn, you want to apply forward pitch to get it going again. So let's do that again. I'll bring it in close. Rudder and aileron, pulling back on pitch, and then applying forward pitch to get it going again. Okay, now let's just do some simple ovals. Notice how sometimes I pull back on that pitch to tighten it up. And now a simple easy turn. Okay. <laughs> I got a niche. Hold on. There we go. Uh, let's see how much I got left on this battery here. 
What I think I wanted to demonstrate is a climb and pirouette with a climb. I got a lot of power left in that battery. So I'm trying out this uh, controller cam. I hope it's coming out. I'll try to use it more often in my flights because people have been asking for further tips on turning. Oh, uh, I don't know if you noticed, but the V212 is a great little flyer. It's kind of an overlooked quadcopter. I don't know why. I had some bad press in the beginning about dropouts uh, occurring. I had dropouts when I originally bought this V212 and I contacted Banggood. They sent me a replacement circuit board and that corrected the problem. And since then it's been a great flyer. It's one of my favorites. Next to the... For outdoor flying, this is my, my best trainer that I use. I fly this a lot. At least a couple times a week. wind at my back here. It's trying to push this away from me. So I'm just continuing doing simple turns, just demonstrating so that you can all see how to do it. Okay, I think that gets the point. And my battery's probably getting low by now, so I'm going to bring it in. See if I can land it back where I took off. Here it is. Satellite Lake. Satellite Dry Lake, RC Park. Here in Ridgecrest, California. he make it we'll find out yay <laughs> okay again satellite dry lake model aircraft flying facility um, I hope you learned something here today and quadcopter 101 signing off